Florida Governor Ron DeSantis are said he did not pick the fight over the state's new curriculum on slavery, which calls for students to be taught that enslaved people developed skills that some used for their benefit. That has stirred widespread controversy. DeSantis said in an interview with Brett Bayer that aired Monday on Fox News that Vice President Harris has lied about what the state's standards are. Harris slammed the curriculum earlier this month during a visit to Florida in which she accused extremists of trying to push propaganda to students, while DeSantis has said the curriculum is being misrepresented. We didn't pick the fight, Brett DeSantis said. You can't bend the knee to the left's lies. When the left lies and creates these phony narratives, you've got to push back," he added. Harris is not the only prominent official who has criticized the standards, with the curriculum also yielding attacks from several black Republicans serving in Congress. Senator Tim Scott R.S. C., another presidential candidate, denounced the standards on multiple occasions, saying that no silver lining exists to slavery and that the institution is antithetical to who we are. Representative Byron Donald's Republican Florida and DeSantis's campaign clashed after Donald said he supported the vast majority of the curriculum and considered it good, robust accurate, but took issue with an attempt to feature the personal benefits of slavery. Aides to DeSantis accused Donald's of taking talking points from Harris and other members of the Biden administration. Donald said he was surprised to receive criticism over his comments. Posting online, anyone who can't accurately interpret what I said is disingenuous and is desperately attempting to score political points. Representatives Wesley Hunt Republican Texas and John James Republican Michigan also criticized the standard. The curriculum requires teaching on race to be objective and not indoctrinate or persuade students to a particular point of view. One part requires instruction on how slaves develop skills which in some instances, could be applied for their personal benefit. DeSantis said in the interview that the adoption of the curriculum was a public process in which objections could have been raised previously. He said Republicans should have pushed back against Harris's comments. What Republicans should have done is push back against her, say you're operating in bad faith, he said. DeSantis has said students are to be taught under the provision that enslaved people received the skills in spite of slavery, not because of it.